I haven't posted on this channel in a while, yes, yes, I know, but I have a good reason. As you can see from the title of this video, my friends and I have been working on something that I think is pretty cool. We call it Mechie, and it is essentially the leak code for mechanical engineering. In case you haven't heard, leak code is a tool that software engineers use to prepare for software engineering interviews. So if you're a software engineer and you wanna work at FANG, you know, Facebook, Meta, Apple, Netflix, Google, whatever, you will go on leak code, grind it, as in you'll do 300, 400, 500 coding questions, and these questions will be asked in technical interviews. Then that's for software engineering. What do we have for mechanical engineering? You see, I studied mechanical engineering for years when I was in university, and I could never find something equivalent to leak code for software engineering, so I decided to build it. I've made content for years that helped mechanical engineering students land amazing mechanical engineering jobs at Tesla, Apple, Meta, Google, etc. But I want to compile it all into one platform that could be the go-to for mechanical engineering the same way leak code is the go-to for software engineering. This platform is called Meki. Let's have a look at what my team and I have been building over the last few months. Keep in mind, I say a few months, but we've been working on it for almost a year. Time just really flew by. I want to take you through the app. Essentially, when you go on Mechie.io, you're going to see this series of onboarding pages. It'll ask you a personalized question about yourself to learn how it can best make your life easier and helping you land these technical interviews. Once you're done with the onboarding, you're gonna see a long list of technical questions. They are categorized by difficulty, as well as categorized by subjects. So you have material science, heat transfer, mechanics questions, etc. You'll also have easy, medium, and hard, so you're able to kind of choose what type of questions you want to do. Now, when you see a row of questions, you can click on it to see a more detailed view of the question. Once you do, you're gonna see this beautiful whiteboard that you can use to solve a question. For example, if you click on a question that says draw a stress strain curve, you can now use the whiteboard to practice drawing that curve. And that's a question that you can be asked in interviews. So this platform gives you the opportunity to practice. And what's even better is underneath the whiteboard, there is feedback from AI that will tell you whether you did a good job or not. And if you're missing something, it'll give you some detail on what it is that you're missing. And the reason we chose to do the whiteboard this way in which you have to use your cursor to draw is because in virtual technical interviews, it's gonna be a Google Meets or a Zoom shared screen. We're gonna to have to draw on the screen and the interviewer sees your work in that way. So I decided to replicate exactly what the interview style would be like when you're practicing. Leak code allows you to code on the screen. Here with Meki, you can draw on screen. Anyways, now you just solved the question, you got some AI feedback, you submitted it, but you want to see the true and accurate solution. No worries, if you go back to the question, click play, you're going to see a video solution that was curated by me that gives you detail on what the final answer should look like. So with Meki, you're not just practicing random questions you see online, you're learning step by step how to actually stand out as a mechanical engineer that's doing technical interviews. Honestly, the only way before Meki to prepare for mechanical engineering interviews is to just Google mechanical engineering interview questions. You're going to see a bunch of things on Glassdoor, on Reddit. Some of them are semi-accurate, but there is no solution. There is no way to verify that these questions were actually asked in interviews. Whereas with Meki, every single question there was verified and was asked in interviews. And there's solutions that are verified and correct, and it allows you to actually practice answering that question the same way you would answer in a technical interview. So if you're a mechanical engineering student or mechanical engineering recent grad, and you've struggled for months or even years to land your dream mechanical engineering job that's high paying, Mechie's there for you. And we're really going all in and trying to do something special for the first 1,000 users. We'll give you full access to the platform, enter into a private Discord community, and personalized sessions with myself. I built Mechie because it's what I wished I had when I was in my third year or fourth year of engineering. It's what I wish I had when I was a recent grad. Uh, I was faced with so many questions, even when I was in first year on how do I even land any job at Tesla or Apple or whatever. I was faced with all these questions and I learned so much in the past four years and I just compiled it all into Menke. And it's not just what I learned, but it's me, 
my peers, everything, all the questions you've ever been asked, we just compiled it into this app and you made it very easy to not just read the questions, but to also practice and learn and get better. So you stand out in your technical interviews. So that's Mechie. Uh, that's what I've been working on. That's the app that I've been building. Uh, if you're a mechanical engineering student and you're trying to land a mechanical engineering job, I'm going to put Mechie.io in the video description. Check it out. Play around the website. See if it's a good fit for you. And if you're not a mechanical engineering student and you've just been watching this video for fun, then watch the journey as I try to build a web app from scratch. Honestly, I've never built a web app like this. It's been really cool to manage a team and manage a product. It's been a lot of work and I've been learning so, so much about communication, time management, basics of coding, just understanding how things even work on the internet. So it's been fun. It's been fun to build a web app. And I don't know if this will ever become like a startup of its own. I feel like that would be cool to like build my own startup. At the end of the day, I just found a problem in a very niche community and I'm trying to solve it. Uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see how people perceive this. And I think it's pretty cool. I always learned that whenever I see a problem in a community, you just try to come up with the solution. So that's what I'm doing. Anyways, I hope this video brought you value. Here's to being more consistent with content. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.